song is on my mind i just heard this song i always hear it in passing i just wanna praise you forever and ever for all oh there's a part that says thank you jesus for blessing me such a blessing um god is so good God is so good. God is so good. Like, God never ceases to amaze me. I just want to praise you forever. I didn't even think I was going to do any video. I knew that the Holy Spirit wanted me to do a video, but I wasn't thinking of doing a video. Like, I'm literally sitting by the heater right now. And just, I'm with the Lord and I just want to praise you for all you've done. I know I'm not singing it right, but <sighs> I'm just waiting to hear from the Holy Spirit. Um, I was actually in the bathroom when I received this, the biggest download ever from the lord and it hit me really hard in my spirit and i felt the holy spirit also put in me that this is a word for somebody it definitely was a word for me <laughs> when i received it it's definitely a word for somebody please don't mind the mess that's i'm in my bedroom that's my bed <laughs> i'm literally sitting on the floor on a cushion next to the heaters it was just unexpected when i do videos like this just know it wasn't that i wouldn't plan i thought i was gonna have a whole setup but no ain't gonna work <sighs> where do i even begin lord <laughs> where do i begin? you know when god just puts so much stuff in you and you're just like okay now i have to now say it <laughs> where do i begin okay thank you holy spirit okay i felt the lord put in my heart i was actually i just went into prayer when the lord showed me that that we need to start praying this way we need to start praying According to what God's will for our lives are. But the Lord put something really specific in my mind that helped me, Holy Spirit. <laughs> he said to me, I, ha I felt it in my heart. And I said, Lord, I pray that every word that has ever come out of your mouth according, according to me, every assignment everything that you have written for me in my book because we all have a book every word fashioned for me it's in the book of i think psalm 139 i'm not sure but i said lord i just it just came over me every word that is written for me in my book every assignment every goal everything that you want me to achieve in this year i pray it, it is fulfilled and i pray to not delay i pray to not not be walking in alignment with you I, and and the lord showed me that he actually sets goals for us he has things that he wants us to achieve from january to december you know how people say, well, you need to set a goal for yourself and what you want to achieve in your life, which there's nothing wrong with that. God also has goals and hopes and dreams for you, you know, which are bigger than what your mind can comprehend. So there are things that God wants. He constantly wants to level us up constantly, constantly. And thank you, Holy Spirit. 
when God increases his desire, when he increases the desire in your heart for him, that means he, he wants to level you up. He wants you to get to a certain maturity, to a certain level of understanding and knowledge and wisdom for him to be able to, to use you in another level that you probably would never think you'd ever reach in your life. And he wants those things to take full manifestation. Oh. Oh. He wants the things like there's this word called manifestation. It's such a powerful word. He wants everything that he speaks upon your life to manifest in your life. Because God's words don't return void. They accomplish everything that it's said to do. He wants every single thing that he has hoped for you, that he has spoken upon you to come to pass. There is no one who wants you to win like the Lord. No matter what you're going through. And no matter what it is that you could be going through in your life. Start praying to come into alignment with his plan for your life. One of the things that I was struggling with before coming to the Lord was I felt like my life was literally going in circles. I felt like it was a cycle. I tried to do everything on my own and it would just it would be like it would be repeating itself. And I just came to him and I thought, Father, I'm tired of doing all of this on my own strength. And when I made that choice, oh, I'm telling you, my life has never been the same. God has completely, God completely changed my life for the better. Walking in obedience, walking in faith, being tested. Sometimes you don't know you're tested. You just hear that you, 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 you've been tested. <laughs> it happens. It happens. But it makes you so much stronger and it makes you, your faith and your walk with God so much better. Start praying that everything that God has written for you in your life to do is fulfilled every year that he gives you, every month, every, every week or whatever. Pray, God, please, let everything that you have spoken upon me be fulfilled and let me not be delayed and give me the strength to carry this out. To carry my assignments out that I need to do in the name of Jesus. That this message, thank you Holy Spirit. It may not be for everyone. But thank you Holy Spirit. Take the word up to the Lord. Pray about it for yourself. You know, pray about it for yourself. And there is a scripture that says, and the days fashioned for me. Thank you. It said days fashioned for me. You know, we're all assigned to an assignment on this earth. We're all here to do something. We're all assigned to an angel that the Lord assigned to us to help us, to guide us. Let us not grieve the Holy Spirit. So... I really pray that y'all catch this because <laughs> I caught it immediately when I got it. I was like, wow, I really pray that I do not even finish the year. I don't want to finish the year without completing what God has planned for me for the year of 2023. Even going forward, everything that he's written out for me to do, to accomplish, to be in obedience, because... <sighs> nothing else there's nothing else so if you've taken the time to watch this message thank you so much may god bless you and i pray i am praying in the mighty name of jesus christ that everything that god has spoken upon you promised you showed you in your dreams written in your book that it is accomplished in the mighty name of jesus christ by the dunamis power of God. <laughs> I 
Thank you, Holy Spirit. I just came into this word dunamis. I didn't know there was a word, a word called dunamis. I had to look it up and I had to research about it. And then like God does this all the time where he would introduce me to a word I've never heard before. And then I'd, I'd, I'd go and research it. And then afterwards, I'd just hear, I'd hear the word over and over again from different kind of people. And I'd be like, hey, that's that word I heard. So by the dunamis power of God, meaning the power, the ability, you know, God is... God is sovereign, God is all-knowing, God can, nothing is impossible for the Lord. So I pray that over you um, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you. God bless you.